Hello YouTube! It's the Geeky Minecrafter here, coming at you with episode 12 of my Let's Play series. Today is part 2 of our XP farm, and I had actually started it uh, and then realized that the video wasn't recording. So let me show you what I've done. I did knock down, if you'll remember, this was uh, one block above this level. I did knock that down, and I replaced this with sandstone also all the way around here. Now my goal, of course, is to build this all the way around um, in a U-shape like this with glass in between here. Let's see if I have any glass handy. Yeah, they're drowning. <laughs> they're not loving life right now. So I'm going to continue this U-shape all the way up. Now I am going to go every other block water, every other block signs. That's water below the glass, so this level is glass. That means this level here will be water. Now I'm going to do this all the way up and then jump back down um, and then come around the back side and uh, give, them a, uh, <laughs> give them a little bit of extra push there. Uh, knock out the blocks and uh, get it where they can go. Now this is going to go all the way up over eight blocks and then drop back down. And I'm going to drop them right over here. My reason for doing this, and I, I think it's a slight improvement to Data's design, by, by building my room right here, I'm going to be forcing these zombies to spawn, uh, because, you know, zombies spawn when you're around, and I'm going to be standing right over the spawner. Now the other thing I'm going to do um, is I'm probably going to build both U-shapes before I knock this, uh, knock this block out where they can come get me. Um, that's just, you know, I, I'm, uh, I'm a coward. I'm a chicken. Data fights them, you know, like crazy as they're coming out. Um, I've died fighting them uh, when, they, when they swarm like that, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be safe. So I think that's it. Let me think. Do I have everything I need? Oh, I did think of one other thing. Um, I'm going to make this walkway that's up in the sky, I'm going to make it eight long, and I'm, I'm going to show you why. I'm sure you know about water mechanics, but I, what I've done is dig an, a nine long trench, and I've placed a water source right here. Come on. Okay, so there's no water there. If I place the water source right here, you can see that it flows exactly eight blocks and then stops. So if this were to actually be dug down a little bit, it would send something, anything that's dropped off there, it would send it right off the edge and down. I'm going to build the channel around this. So in other words, like this, this is going to be on the other end, or, or it, up in the sky, this is going to be on the other end. So with this, and actually I think I think according to data, I have to go one one more, like this, or maybe it's move it back. I believe it's have an open air block uh, like this, so uh, so that they don't get tied up. And I'll I'll go one higher like this, and then we'll cap it off. So this is what I'm going to build up on top, and this is going to be the the fall hole, if you will. So basically, let's oh just jumped right in the water, didn't I? Oh, I was headed the wrong place. So basically, that's what I'm going to do. What I will do is hush and speed the video up so you don't have to uh, listen to me complain about the zombie noise. <laughs> and hopefully it, it does get better the higher we get. Um, I will be adding this stuff as I go. So, like, underneath this is water. That means this is a sign level. Um, so I will be doing this, popping this in, and then this will be a water level. Uh, so I will, you know, do it as I go, so I don't have to come back through here and do it again. And then all I'll do is, um, underneath, I'll dig it out and then let them through. So that's it. That's my method. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get started. You guys enjoy the music.
Well, if you can believe it, <laughs> I am one water short, which means I'm going to have to nerd pull back up here with water. Good grief. Okay. Um, yeah, this is where... <laughs> There's a leap of faith right here, man. I hope I haven't made this too far away from the wall. I mean, uh, too close to the wall. Wish me luck! Oh, yeah. Let's get my sword out, because there's some creepy crawlies over here. Let's see, how close is everybody? Let's, let's try. Now, I'm wondering if I miscounted, because um, I really thought I had enough to take it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. See, I should have had enough. That's twelve waters. I uh, maybe mislabeled them. So, w if it's twelve waters and twelve signs, that should be enough. All right, let's let's get some dirt. Let's nerd pull up and uh, and see for sure. See, it might be easier with sand. Do I have enough sand? I have 14. Ah, uh, yeah, here's a stack of sand. Let me go ahead and fill up some water, and uh, we'll nerd pull back up and either finish or correct it.
Okay. Now, let's see if it works. You're headed up. I should have probably left the ladders up there just in case. They should be dropping down. Right? Uh oh. Well, why aren't they dropping down? Hmm. Okay. Oh. Was I just not being patient? Let's do this. Let's, uh... Hmm. Okay, I'm one too high, it looks like. Uh, that's not good. Yeah. Let's see if raising it one does anything for us. go. Missed it by one, in other words. Oh, what happened to him? Maybe sunshine damage? Let's go ahead and close that off. <laughs> Does he really have a band-aid on his head? Okay, so looks like what I'm going to need to do... Yeah, this is too far back, isn't it? cooking with gas. Okay, so I just made this one too deep. That's fine. Uh, I can take this off. Oh, we're coming on dark. Let's, uh, let's go recharge the batteries.
Okay, uh, I know we've been recording for a while. I apologize for how long it's taken to do this. I've uh, learned a few things, uh, made a few mistakes, and died a couple of times. So the theory here, let's okay. see, let's, I've got one too many uh, blocks out here. So let's go. I have my silk touch. Oh, that's water. Uh, let's fix that. this. So one thing I will do is I'll make this look all nice. Um, I'll build a um, build a house over this so I can sit in here, you know, behind iron doors and AFK for a while, build up the zombies. Uh, it looks like it's not producing as fast as Datus. Maybe he has a different spawner or maybe he waited quite a while. I, I do recall him saying he waited a whole day in a night cycle before he tried to uh, start killing them. So let's, uh, I'll do the same thing. I'll just uh, walk away for a little bit and see how many uh, build up. I will probably also uh, build a room around this while I'm off camera. There's no reason for you guys to sit through the tedious process of my building. So I think that's it. I think we're going to call this episode, this is, as Data calls it, the Arch of Death. And the theory here is it's going to drop them down just enough that uh, they'll collect back here and we'll be able to uh, get a bunch of experience points all at once. It should only take one hit to knock them down. And in fact, it should take one hit with just about anything. Um, fence post, glass, you know, heck, even a tree shrub so that I'm not uh, using up my sword. So I'm going to go let them collect. I'm going to build the building around. And uh, next episode, I will check in with you and show you the room that I've built. Okay. So this is the Geeky Minecrafter signing out. I hope you enjoyed this XP farm video. Uh, if you did, please like or subscribe down below and let your friends know. So this is, uh, this is me signing out. Till next time, happy mining.